Clock, the popular marijuana dispensary Maggie's Farm is at the center of a two county investigation tonight. Deputies with the El Paso and Pueblo County Sheriff's offices seized cash from multiple locations. Cardio 13's Tyler Cunnington is live in our newsroom after speaking with a locksmith who helped deputies get inside. Tyler, what can you tell us about this investigation? Yeah, Bart Heather, that locksmith tells me that he and his two co-workers were sent to three different Maggie's Farm locations early this morning, all at the same time. It was for what law enforcement calls a till tap warrant, which is when cash is seized from a business due to a court order. But tonight, the sheriff's offices won't tell Cardio 13 why they had to take the cash. These are two of the Maggie's Farm dispensaries that law enforcement officers busted into today. They wanted in there pretty quickly as soon as we, we got on site. Um, so they got like crowbars and stuff and started yanking on doors. And the El Paso County and Pueblo County Sheriff's offices using a local locksmith to execute a court ordered civil warrant. They took cash from the locations in Banatu Springs, along I-25 in Pueblo and on East Fillmore in Colorado Springs. There was a lot of paperwork, a whole lot of records or whatever. They, I mean, they had it piled all over the place in the hallway and uh, in the stairway. I did um, 11 doors and uh, three like cabinets. The court ordered till tap is when one party presents evidence to a judge that money is owed to them by a person or business. But legal experts say it's incredibly rare because no businesses carry that much cash, with exception, however, to dispensaries. Most businesses do not have have a cash register. And if there is a judgment against a business that has a cash register, that business is likely already out of business. Now we've reached out multiple times by phone and email to Maggie's Farm and its CEO about why law enforcement sees their money. As of right now, we're still waiting to hear back. Reporting live in our newsroom, Tyler Cunnington, Cardio 13. Mm -hmm.